I hitched a ride up to Mena, Arkansas to pick up our newly painted Skyhawk, and I couldn't believe my eyes. After owning November 80991 for almost two years, we finally made the decision to get her repainted, and the airplane is beyond beautiful. The airplane takes off faster, glides much further, and I experienced an increase in airspeed from 106 knots to 116 knots. The newly painted airplane carries a whole new attitude now, and it further solidified my decision to keep the Skyhawk 80991 legacy alive in my logbook for many more years to come. This flight begins in Mena, Arkansas where the paint shop is located, and my objective is to fly it all the way home to San Marcos, Texas. But first, I have to stop at a little airport in McKinney, Texas because my instructor Brandon is dying to see the new paint job. This flight took place about a week before my instrument check ride, so I was hoping the weather was going to cooperate and stay clear for me, and as the evening progressed, all the METARs changed to clear skies and made for a nice VFR flight home. Mena traffic, Skyhawk 80991 is uh, taxiing into the run up pad, runway 17 Mena. All right, let's do a run-up. Okay, parking brake set. Light control screen correct. That one goes up, that one goes down, that one goes up, that one goes down. Actually, I have a checklist in here. Go to the auxiliary page. Checklists before takeoff. Doors and windows closed and latched. All right, that door's closed and latched, windows are closed, flight controls are incorrect, that one goes up, that one goes down, that one goes up, that one goes down, elevators up, down, rudder, left and right, everything looks correct after the re-rigging, elevator trim, set for takeoff on the wide arrow, flight instruments check, zero, attitude indicator is neutral, altimeter two, nine or, nine or four, and that is set, zero, centered, and I checked that while I was taxiing, and get the gyro set here, the airplane has not run, about a month, well actually it ran, it ran a couple days ago, but it's been in the paint shop. Alright, flight instruments are set, fuel selector is on both. Uh, mixture is rich, yeah, we'll lean it a little bit, high density altitude, the so mixture is set, parking brake is set, throttle up to 1700 RPM. Magneto check, left magneto, clean, back to both. Right mag check. That's the drop I expected, and back to both. Curvy to heat. Clean, back in. Engine instruments, plenty of fuel. Green, green. Responsive with the landing light. Suction is at 5 PSI. Throttle to idle. Okay. Flaps are up. We don't need any flaps for this takeoff. I'm by myself. We're light. Departure procedures. We're probably going to take off, we're going to make right traffic, circle upwards because we've got some terrain around us, get above that terrain, and then go southeast, uh, sorry, southwest bound. So those are reviewed, avionics set, so let's go ahead and get the knee board out. And I'll grab a pen out of my bag here. Alright, our Fort Worth center frequency is 124.87. Okay, so we'll get that in the backup, or the standby frequency there. So avionics are set, and that concludes the before takeoff checklist. Alright, I think we're ready to go. Mina traffic, Skyhawk 80991 is taking runway 17. We're going to make left traffic and uh, climb up. That will be a southwest departure over the field. Mina. All right, transponder to altitude, squawking VFR. Car beat cold, mixture is rich. Flaps are up. Fuel selectors on both trims, separate takeoff. All the lights on. All right, line up with the runway. Double check the heading. Looks good. All right, heels down to the floor, full power. 
Alright, throttle the firewall. Green, green. Airspeed's alive. 50. 55. 60. There's 70 knots. 75. She's climbing real well. Mina traffic, Skyhawk 80991 on the upwind runway 17. are going to make a left traffic climbing turn. Mina traffic. Once we get 500 feet here, we'll make a left hand turn. Mina traffic, Skyhawk 80901 is about one nautical mile to the southwest of the field, southwest bound. We're climbing through 3,000 feet, departing the area to the southwest. Mina traffic. And forward center, Skyhawk November 80901. Skyhawk 80901, go ahead. Mr. Skyhawk 80901, we departed from Mina Airport, that is Mike Echo Zulu. And we're approximately 1.5 miles to the southwest of that airport. We're at 6,500. We're going to Tango 31. That's Arrow Country. Hey, Skyhawk 80991, Squawk 0560, 0560, I'm dead, please. All right, 0560, and we'll give you the ID, 80991. Hey, 2666, you can expect visit approach 22, if I was going to have the airport in sight. Hey, 2666, thank you. Nothing from 80991, radar contact, six ten out seven two nine nine one. Nine nine one, nine nine one, thanks. Nothing from 80901, next. Or correction, nothing from 80901. How far traffic? Your twelve to one o'clock in three miles eastbound two o six. Yeah, seven thousand. It'll pass off to your left. Okay, we're looking for the traffic, and uh, it's kind of hazy up here. Negative contact. Yes. Yeah, traffic's in sight uh, for 80991. He's passing through by 1130 now. 9991, roger. Alright, there's McKinney. Radio 5 Southwest 213, 6000. So 213, Mitch Post, thanks. Would you like 13 left or 13 right? Alright, we're looking for 1800 feet, 1800, so we can expedite this descent just a little bit more. 7 minutes out, passing through 4700 now. Come back, come back, ready contact 5 north of the Rockwell Airport. Pull just a little bit of power out. And rich net just a little bit. 80991, Aero Country in sight. Skyhawk 991, thanks. No observed traffic between you and Aero Country Airport. Radar service terminated. Squawk 1200, frequency change approved. Have a good night. Roger, Squawk VFR, change approved. 80991, good night. Southwest 1911, turn left heading 270. Heading 270, Southwest 1911. Aero Country traffic, Skyhawk 80991. 2,000 feet, we're approximately uh, three miles to the north of the field. We're going to come in straight in, runway 17, full stop, Aero Country. Alright, we are lit up. Carp heat coming out. We're outside of the green arc on the RPM. Hey, Skyhawk inbound for Arrow Country. We are five north, uh, kind of uh, northwest. We'll watch for you. Be number two. Okay, Roger. I'm literally turning a two mile final now for 17. Arrow Country traffic. Sting 59 or 5 Lima. Departing runway 17. Arrow Country. Arrow Country traffic, Skyhawk 80991, two mile final, runway 17, full stop, Arrow Country, we got the traffic getting on the runway. 1-1000, 1000 1000 visibility is fantastic down here. Alright, I got the traffic on upwind. Arrow Country traffic, Skyhawk 80991, on short final, runway 17, full stop, Arrow Country. Got a little bit of a crosswind from the left, I believe. So our nose is pointed left, so I would need to give it some right rudder. 1,000, 2,1,000, That's full flaps deployed. Air country traffic, staying 5905 Luma. 
left downwind on 17, but we'll be departing to the north. And Aero Country traffic, one Bravo Sierra is two mile final, 17, Aero Country. Aero Country traffic, Skyhawk 80991 is rolling out runway 17. We're going to make a right turn to the fuel pumps, Aero Country. Needless to say, Brandon was blown away by how the airplane looked now. It was totally unrecognizable to the both of us, and I'm excited to fly the hell out of it with its new paint.